This is Imola. Once part of the Formula One World Championship calendar, this historical track named after Enzo and Dino Ferrari hails from North Central Italy and has been subject to numerous revisions since it was founded in 1953. From 1953 to 1972, the track went uninterrupted from Rivaza all the way to the infamous Tamborello Corner notorious for its bumpy surface and having a dangerously small amount of room between the track and the concrete wall as the Santerno River runs directly behind it. From 1972 to 1974, two chicanes were added in an effort to slow drivers down. The Variante Bassa, lower chicane, and Variante Alta, higher chicane, situated at the top of the hill leading down to Ravaza, creating the hardest breaking point on the track. In 1980, Imola made its debut in the Formula One Grand Prix, after organizers were engaged in a dispute with Monza. In 1981, Imola remained in the F1 circuit as the San Marino Grand Prix. The circuit was subject to constant safety concerns even after adding numerous chicanes. Tamborello Corner was especially dangerous, where a car crashed into the wall in 1987 and another in 1989. The tragic weekend of the 1994 San Marino Grand Prix shocked the motor racing world. Rubens Barrichello would survive a serious crash at Variante Bassa. But sadly, both Roland Ratzenberger and Ayrton Senna lost their lives that weekend. So in 1995, major revisions were made to the track layout. Tamborello Corner, previously taken flat out, was converted into a fourth gear left-right sweeper and a gravel trap was added outside the corner. Villeneuve Corner was also made a fourth gear sweeper with a gravel trap. In an attempt to retain some of the quickness and character of the old circuit, the chicane at Aqua Minerale was eliminated. Variante Bassa was also eventually removed to make way for a more modernized, longer pit lane. After 2006, Imola was dropped from the Formula One World Championship due to lack of funds. Whether Imola will once again be a part of the Formula One World Championship is unknown. Today, Imola is home to the annual Four Hours of Imola, part of the European Le Mans series. It remains a popular bike racing circuit and has implemented minor changes over the years to be used solely for motorbike events. Imola is an important track in motor racing history. It's a track that yearns to be back in the spotlight.